You can still hear children playing coming from Kayfield Academy, even after the parents of Shivani Jishnu have filed a lawsuit against this daycare, wondering how their daughter died after being in their care. When we go home, we go as goodbye, your kisses to us, and walked into the car and went to the daycare. And the next moment, we see her with like all kinds of monitors and tubes. What's even harder for the parents of Shivani Jishnu to accept is that even now, after saying goodbye to their baby girl in January, they still have questions as to how she got to be hospitalized for 23 days before tragically dying. Knowing, this, knowing all these answers uh, will help us understand what really happened. On December 16th, they got a call that their 13-month-old daughter was rushed to Norton Children's Hospital after medical emergency at her daycare, Kayfield Academy. Doctors believe Shivani was without oxygen for 20 minutes. Shivani's mother says the stories about what happened didn't add up from the beginning when daycare workers told the EMTs the child was napping when they found her unresponsive. Almost four days after that, uh, that's when we, uh, I went to take care and we met, uh, I asked them what happened. They mentioned that she was away. Soon after, the family requested video from the facility, but they were told they didn't have any, even though the daycare claimed to have cameras in every room. Attorney Terry Goodspeed says nothing makes sense. We know that there's a lot more information out there that we're not being told, uh, and that's really the the basis of why we have to bring this lawsuit is because we have to get answers and we have to hold the folks accountable for what occurred here. The lawsuit alleges daycare employees gave false information to EMTs, had child to staff ratio violations and didn't properly train employees. These parents say they just want to know how this happened, even as they still struggle to understand why. You know, today I like her to say what she did. I, I know that she's not good. Except that she's not dead. Gladys Bautista, WOKY News. An attorney for Kayfield Academy says it does not comment on pending litigation.